heritage of india time to think name three famous state festivals of india india is a land of people following varying lifestyles through their long experience developed thoughts and language music and dances arts and architecture science and literature they are passed down to us from earlier generations and forms our heritage heritage is of two types natural heritage and cultural heritage natural heritage includes forests animals birds rivers mountains valleys deserts minerals and other natural features of our country cultural heritage includes monuments or buildings coins pillars and rock inscriptions places of worship dance drama music pottery paintings language and literature and fairs and festivals the rituals and customs are also a part of our cultural heritage language and literature language is a medium of communication through which we express our views and understand the views of others there are 22 major languages spoken in india almost every state in our country has its own language hindi is the most common language spoken by the majority of people in our country we have a rich collection of literature books which is an important part of our heritage this includes religious literature books that deal with religion and non religious literature religious literature includes the ramayana the mahabharata the bhagavad gita the vedas and the puranas non religious literature includes stories dramas poems etc written by famous writers dance and music india has a rich tradition of dance and music dance has always been a means of religious worship and entertainment there are two main forms of dance and music classical and folk classical dance and music dance which is religious and spiritual in content is called a classical dance people who practice the art of classical dancing are called classical dancers classical dancers are a form of worship in which a dancer used to perform in temples these dances need not to be performed in groups classical dance forms need formal training and regular practice for example bharatnatyam of tamil nadu odissi of odisha earlier odisha and kathakali of kerala and classical dance forms of india some famous classical dancers are geeta chandran and raja reddy the traditional music influenced by religious and folk music is called classical music classical music is mainly of two kinds hindustani music it was developed in northern india carnatic music it was developed in southern india veena sitar sarod flute mridangam tabla etc are some of the musical instruments that are used in classical music some famous classical musicians are ustad amjad ali khan and shrimati h s subulakshmi folk dance and music folk dances and songs are an expression of joy on various events like weddings festivals beginning of a new season and sowing or harvesting of crops folk music is also known as folk or it can be defined as music transmitted by word of mouth from one generation to another this music is composed by common people during their work or leisure folk dances are usually performed in groups for example bhangra of punjab dandiya and garba of gujarat ghumar of rajasthan nati of himachal pradesh and bihu of assam are some famous indian folk dances art and architecture man by nature is a lover of art india has a glorious history of art and architecture the indian kings and emperors were the great patrons of art the carvings and paintings on the walls of the ancient temples 
palaces and caves are of the highest level of perfection. The painting in the caves of Ajanta and Ellora show scenes from the life of Buddha. Under the Mughal rule, miniature paintings became popular. These paintings show court scenes, hunting, landscapes, battles and scenes from the Ramayana and the Mahabharata. Our country is very rich in architecture. Temples, places and forts built by earlier rulers are the valuable sources of information about the life of the people in ancient times. The ruins of the Indus Valley Civilization, the Buddhist stupas of Sachi and Sarnath, the Sun Temples at Khajuraho, Jain Temples at Mount Abu, the Taj Mahal, the enduring monument of love at Agra, the Red Fort at Delhi and the forts and palaces in Rajasthan are some gems of our architectural heritage. Culture and Customs Festivals India is known as a land of festivals. Here people celebrate many festivals. They are mainly of three types. National festivals. Every person in the country celebrates these festivals. For example, Independence Day, Republic Day and Gandhi Jayanti. Religious festivals. People of different religions celebrate different festivals. For example, Diwali, Eid, Guru Purab, Christmas, the Shara, etc. Harvest festivals. These festivals are associated with the harvesting seasons. For example, Holi, Basant Panchmi, Pongal, Baisakhi, Onam, etc. Dress and jewelry. Dress and jewelry differ from one stage to another, largely depending on the traditions and the climatic conditions of that particular region. The sari is the most popular dress among women in India. The Ghagra Choli is a common dress in Gujarat, Madhya Pradesh, Rajasthan and Haryana. Piran is a long woolen gown worn by women in Kashmir. Many city girls wear western apparel like jeans, trousers, skirts and shirts. Men usually wear kurta pajama, dhoti kurta, lungi, shirt, trousers etc.